It is the 25th of the 2nd, 2013. This is today's climate change update. Well, you have to excuse me, I have a pretty bad chest cold. I've been winter hiking uh, in prep for my 430 mile AT section hike this summer with my baby brother. Uh, so let's go ahead and get started. <clears throat> Earth changes, Scott.net, or Sot.net, I'm sorry. Second blizzard in less than two weeks hits the U.S. Plain states worse than the last one. Blizzard conditions slam slammed into Central Plains Monday, forcing closures of highways in the Texas and Oklahoma panhandles and sending public work crews scrambling for salt and sand anew just days after a massive storm blanketed the region with snow. And uh, being a Midwesterner, uh, yeah, we definitely got some snow here, but uh, not a lot in Des Moines. Uh, it's pretty much south of me. Uh, Arizona Highway Sinkhole is actually a whole mountain coming apart. You remember that highway that was shut down because uh, uh, a lot of the road gave way there. The giant fissure in the ground swallowed two cars in Page, Arizona and caused 120 feet of highway to sink over 8 feet. But geologists are now also worried that the road may be irreparable for a long time because it appears that the whole side of the mountain is sinking. Dozens dead of sea creatures, dozens of dead sea creatures wash up in Peru. This is an ongoing situation. You remember last year they had hundreds and hundreds of dolphins and birds and pelicans and everything else washing up dead on this beach. Uh, experts are trying to work out why nearly 100 dead animals and birds have washed up on a Peruvian coastline. Bodies of 18 sea turtles, 22 sea lions, 8 dolphins, 16 angular rough sharks, and 22 marine birds were found during an inspection by government officials. And uh, people are saying it's the oil companies doing something off coast there. And then, of course, the oil companies say it's not us. Could it be Fukushima? We never know because they don't tell us. Northern Hemisphere sets new all time record cold temperature. Minus 96.1 degree Fahrenheit in Siberia. And that shatters the old 71.2 degrees Celsius record of 68 degrees Celsius. Wow. Or, uh, so the old record was 90.4 and it just went to 96.1. That's, yeah, that's 6 degrees and then some. Heavy rains and flooding isolate thousands in New South Wales, Australia. Australia is under the gun again. It's been non-stop for our uh, brothers down under and sisters, of course. About 4,000 are isolated on the New South Wales northern coast region is hit with damaging winds, strong rains, and flooding. Severe weather warning is in the place for the northern north southwest on uh, New South Wales, I'm sorry, with the Bureau of Meteorology warning very Heavy rains leading to flash flooding over the northern rivers, mid-north coast, northern tablelands, and hunter forest districts. Wow. Weather radar catches massive bug swarm over New Zealand. A vast swarm of bugs covered much of the northern half of the North Island last night and this morning has been caught on the Met Service weather radar. That's a lot of bugs. Landslides and flooding for tor from torrential rain kill 17 in Indonesia. Again, a very unstable country. A lot of things going on there. Remnants of super winter storm to dump staggering amounts of rain on the southeast United States. So all my AT through hikers, you're about to get rained on majorly. Enjoy the views. Uh... Then they've got another story going on about uh, the different landslides and grounds giving way across the, the, the globe, of course. The Great Collapse, crust weakening, slipping, and collapsing across the planet. UK, Spain, Kashmir, China, and the United States, of course. New Zealand's White Island Volcano Stirs sends out ash clouds. This is on the extinction protocol now. Uh, White Island is stirring again, but volcanologists say activity within the crater is only minor. Uh, nothing to worry about there, folks. Uh, very active area. Over to the nuclear stuff. We have a lot, a lot going on. And I know I didn't cover uh, when the building collapsed or the roof collapsed at Chernobyl, if you haven't heard about that. Um, that was in the actual 
um, generating room, the steam generation room, not the actual reactor room where they have it entombed kind of thing. Um, but they are 10 years behind on their big sarcophagus thing, and that thing's only supposed to fix it for 100 years, uh, which just goes to show they have no idea what the hell they're doing uh, when it comes to nuclear energy and dealing with these crises uh, that have been going on for, you know, over 30 years now in Chernobyl. And uh, the insanity continues. <coughs> e, e News. Gunderson, Fukushima plume went down on ground, unlike Chernobyl. Due to building wake effect, radiation exposure is going to be higher for people nearby. They actually had the big mushroom cloud and all that debris come raining back down. Uh, Caldecott, Fukushima disaster, the worst thing that's ever happened. I agree, so far, that we know about. I've never seen anything so desp despicable in decades of being a doctor. Japan agency reports 37 earthquakes near the location of today's powerful 6.2 earthquake in Japan. You got to remember that whole island is right there on the shelf and it is slowly sliding into the Pacific Ocean. Granted, in geological terms, um, it's sliding now and uh, we just can't see it because we don't live that long. But uh, yeah, that island is definitely shaking. Great place for nuclear, uh, nuclear power plants. Gunderson, we're getting reports from Japan of deformed children. Troubled pregnancies after Fukushima. This is just getting started. Uh, wait 30, 60, 90 years from now, and uh, people will look back to these times and be very angry uh, at the people for letting this happen. Nuclear energy is a crime against humanity. Uh, here's something even more fun. Syrian rebels present IAEA with demands over a captured nuclear facility. Quote, we're willing to cooperate if our conditions are met, unquote. Special security perimeter has been set up. Now, this is a Syrian um, nuclear facility that the Israelis bombed, and uh, they just kind of buried it over real loose dirt and said, uh, no, nothing was here. Uh, so no telling what's there, what's going on. And again, uh, they're going to get the UN in there to uh, enforce this one little area that the rebels have captured. Uh, off the Colbert, uh, Corbett report, thyroid cancer skyrocketing right now in Fukushima. Guardian, the issue is bound to escalate further. That is a major understatement. Uh, again, we're just getting started with this, folks. We're just getting started. It'll be 300 years before the cesium to be gone, let alone the plutonium MOX fuel. The plutonium nobody's talking about. Everywhere. Report nuclear facility captured by rebels in Syria. Fukushima family's on edge of meltdown. Nobody trusts the government anymore. Officials, quote, afraid of triggering, triggering an exodus, and that would be, lose their tax base now, wouldn't it? It's money over people, people. Money over people. Uh, Gunnarsson, soon after 311 photo shows nuclear fuel is exposed to the air at Fukushima Unit Number 4 pool. Clean path for, pl for plutonium to escape off-site. you got to remember, uh, some of the European nations were reporting um, plutonium in their air samples in aerosol form. You remember, they're dumping all this seawater on these reactors and these cooling tanks. Fox, Seattle, nuclear waste, waste leaks at Hanford are far worse than we thought. First there was one tank, then there was two tanks, then there could be up to six tanks. How many tanks are there? How old are these tanks? Why are they still here? They are under contract law to take care of this nuclear waste. And they just keep burying it over and burying it over. <sighs> Japan TV, the nuclear waste curse. Animation shows spent fuel rods being exposed in Fukushima pool. Newsweek cover, asteroid apocalypse, question mark, why scientists worry about 2036 planet buster. Head of Russian space agency talks, takes um, threat of collision seriously, stating we have to prepare for the worst. Now they're not saying this is an Armageddon style um, asteroid, like the movie Armageddon. Uh, more like a city bla bu buster. Um, 
It is supposed to swing past real close in 2029. I posted a video about the RT sh changing the subject on this, uh, this particular asteroid. And it's supposed to smash through our satellite um, blanket um, in 2029 and then come back in 2036 and, and hit us. So uh, no telling what's going on. And again, you know, these are NASA's numbers. And uh, we'll see. Time will tell. News blackout over mystery barrels in Lake Superior. Purpose ooze bouncing Geiger counters reporting. No imminent health threat to public. Don't worry, folks. Everything's completely under control. TV on U.S. nuclear waste leak. Feds, quote, quote, just trying to figure out exactly what's going on here. And that's where they catch you. Well, we're not going to tell you anything until we know everything. Okay, you a bunch of two-year-olds. Uh, and that's all about Hanford, of course. That situation is far worse than we will ever know. Governor, quote, we received very disturbing news today. Radioactive leak in U.S. nuclear site much larger than first reported. No immediate health risks. Don't worry, folks. Uh... Huff Post, alarming that bluefin tuna near California still have Fukushima contamination. Study shows plant most likely to continues to leak. Still has. It will have for millions and millions of years if there's any fish left. Let's see what the mutations do. And remember, we still have Godzilla to look forward to. Surprise! Um, Maninchi, it's emerged... That radiation surged to 700 times normal before people evacuated near Fukushima plant. Residents exposed to high levels. <gasps> Surprise! Agents inspect mystery uh, bubbling by another Louisiana salt dome. A different Louisiana salt dome. We found foaming residue. Something's happening. Witness the lines of bubbles stretch for thousands of feet. And they have videos attached to this, of course. I highly regret you go down and push that link. Pile of sediments filmed at Fukushima Unit Number 1. TEPCO tape taking sample from corner of Taurus Room. And, uh, yeah, they're finding pieces of fuel. Newspaper uncontrolled gas well in Gulf is highly pressured. New flyover of area, numerous work supply vessels. That's right, we have another major oil and gas leak in the Gulf of Mexico. That form is cracked and uh, ongoing, but you don't hear about that on the mainstream news either. Mysterious bubbling reported by Salt Dome 50 miles from giant Louisiana sinkhole. Sheriff's asking motorists to stay away, just to be safe, of course. Uh, that is all I have for you tonight. Um, of course, if I missed anything, and I always miss something, uh, please let me know. Leave your comments. Attach your videos below. Um, I'm here. I know I've been very chaotic uh, lately. <coughs> um, it's pretty discouraging uh, as far as the news goes. Uh, thank you for your encouragement uh, on the internet and please for me to come back. Uh, I will try to make more videos as I can, as often as I can. So uh, expect me two, three times a week at least. I'm going to make it a point to make at least two or three of these a week and uh, we'll try to keep track of what's going on and at least document uh, for us. Um, what's happening. The reality of the whole thing, if you take too many steps back and look at the huge picture, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's some pretty scary stuff. And you got to get past that. Um, I'm living right now for the now. Um, again, I'm planning vacations with my family. And I'm enjoying the time I have here and now. And I encourage you to do the same. So uh, look around you. It's the little things. It really is. Enjoy life. Lap it up and laugh. Laugh as much as you can. Thanks, everybody.